fall is finally here, the best time of year here in Arizona that I think personally. So it's the perfect time to get our homes ready for the holidays. They're coming up. Winter is coming up. Joining us today is the one and only TV host and do-it-yourself star, Chip Wade. Good morning to you, Chip. So happy to have you because you always have the best, easiest ideas in terms of DIY projects. Thanks, Angela. <laughs> so, okay. I, I do, yeah. Today is today is no exception. Yeah. <laughs> that's right. I want to talk about wallpaper. So here we are in Arizona. A lot of people are not doing wallpaper. It's not like living in South Carolina or Alabama where you see wallpaper everywhere. Yeah. What are your thoughts on wallpaper? Wallpaper is actually, uh, it, 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 it's actually great. It's kind of gone up and down in its popularity over the years, but the technology of wallpaper is awesome. Um, obviously, I do a lot of work in Arizona and uh, in Scottsdale and other places. The design style and aesthetic there lends to be a little bit cleaner, um, less, less kind of pattern heavy, which is probably why wallpaper seems to be maybe a little less popular there, but it's popular in a lot of places, and it's a great selection. And there's more modern, uh, sleek uh, options that would uh, work great uh, for a lot of the you know, popular aesthetics there. So those are great ideas for rejuvenating your wallpaper. Maybe you have some bold patterns going a little bit more simple, something like that. Let's talk about tech design. I mean, tech is everywhere in terms of pairing our you know, um, amenities in our kitchens with technology. What do you have with that? So I definitely have some smart home tech uh, that I want to uh, take you through. Back out to the wallpaper thing real fast, though. If you happen, before you wallpaper or before you ever do anything else, actually having a repair of the drywall is incredibly important. Um, a lot of people don't repair their drywall before they do their wall coverings because it takes all day and you have to let all that stuff dry. But I found the DAP Eclipse Rapid Wall Repair Patch. That is awesome. It takes no uh, spackling, no sanding, no additional tools. You literally take it out of the package stick it to the wall, paint it. You just peel back this little plastic sheet and then paint it one more time and you're done. So literally like no tools. It's really, really uh, magical. <laughs> Honestly, how it works because there's just no sanding and it's fast. So quick, quick, quick gratification. Um, you can get that stuff at, um, at Home Depot right now, which is great. This is making its way into everybody's hardware drawers. Uh, but back to smart home tech, I'm doing a uh, an audit of all of my smart home devices right now, kind of culling out the ones that maybe are a little bit old, outdated, or I'm just not using. Uh, I was actually in batteries plus bulbs the other day, and I was so pleasantly surprised that they had a whole like smart home collection set out where there was all the different styles of stuff side by side. So you can really see what is out there. They're all Wi-Fi controlled, which the Wi-Fi controlled stuff is the easiest to set up, the highest internet security, really, really great, and they all work together, which is nice. They have everything from the uh, video doorbells, um, you know, security cameras, uh, Wi-Fi switches, Wi-Fi outlets, all of those different things. In fact, I love the Wi-Fi outlets. I've got my coffee maker plugged into one currently, so 6.30 every morning, boom, it turns on, starts making me a fresh, a fresh brew while I'm still in the shower, uh, and I have extra time in the shower because I'm not having to make my coffee, which is awesome. So, uh, if you're kind of in that market and thinking about refreshing your um, smart home kind of arsenal in your home, check out uh, batteriesplus.com, or of course, you can see it all live in store as well. I love that you use the word auditing your house. I mean, I think of taxes, but I never think of doing a full audit in my house. Just a brilliant word. Um, okay, we're all about right. ROI, right? <laughs> so, so, somebody's got to be the IRS of the home decor, right? And that is you, Chip, for <laughs> sure. Okay, we are all about ROI, our return on our investment. What's the smallest thing we can do for, like, the biggest bang when you walk into our house? Well, making sure that you're not spending too much on your, your, your utility bills. I mean, it really is the kind of the unforeseen thing that just blows everything out of proportion. Get your HVAC serviced. I just did mine last week. It cost me 70 bucks. It's going to be awesome uh, with the energy that uh, just that slight little tune-up is going to make a huge difference. Also, one thing I did last week that you might not think about, clean up your, uh, your refrigeration coils. Uh, that's what caused my uh, electric bill to go up because there was so much dust and lint and debris kind of stuck on the back of it. Um, it was causing my uh, energy bill to go up. So literally a little vacuum and a brush, your ice makers, beverage centers, refrigerators, those all collect that dust and become way less efficient. It takes like two minutes. Clean those up. It's going to be awesome. And then you're going to have money left that you weren't spending to spend on whatever you want. Absolutely. Chip Wade, a pleasure as always. <laughs> Thanks for helping us with our homes and getting them all ready for winter. Thanks, Angela.